Hey guys, Tiffany here. Welcome back to another video. In this week's video, I will be showing you guys how I got my body to the blow after coming back off of our anniversary vacation. And I'm so excited to show you guys this video. This will be a modified version of the detox smoothie cleanse, especially for the people that cannot just only have the smoothie drink breakfast lunch and dinner so i'll show you my modified version stay tuned to the end so you can see the before and after picture and then just hear all the details of what i did in order to achieve these results in only four days without being perfect at it either and don't forget if you like videos like this make sure you give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel hit the bell so that you know every time that i upload a video and i hope you enjoy the video hey guys okay so this one will be not that short and sweet but this beginning portion will be so this past week and a half your girl has been eating crazy but give me a little bit of slack i did go on my anniversary trip so it's just been hard for me to get back into the groove of things so right now what i am doing is i am making pineapple green smoothie it's supposed to be a fat buster it's supposed to be a bloat buster like everything right so I do have a full video showing you guys exactly how I do it from A to Z. It's a little fast paced, but if you pay attention, you can kind of get the gist of what I'm doing. Right now, I'm not gonna show you like A to Z, but I will show you how I am boiling my pineapple peels, and then I'll show you guys the end result. Okay, here's the pineapple peels boiling, and then I'll show you guys the finished results. Here's the pineapples that I'm dicing up at this present moment, and then I also have like a ton of other stuff like ginger, avocado green apple all of that and then um lemon lime and i'll show you guys the finished result also something that i think is huge to say right now is the fact that i'm not getting on the scale like if you're scared to get on the scale just like me right now this is a perfect video for you okay i'm gonna take the measurements today and then we'll regroup back in the next uh, three days to see if we can see a difference on how I'm looking. All right, I will talk to you guys either later or tomorrow. I'll show you finish the result. Okay, and here we go. Now that I've separated it, so you see I, I poured it out of the big jar and then into these small jars. I believe these small jars are 12 ounces a piece. That's, so that's basically what I have for a meal. So that's that, and then I will talk to you guys tomorrow. And then I also wanted to show you guys these pineapple, the rest of the pineapple peels that I had with the pineapple peel juice. And then that's what I will be keeping stored. So when I make my next batch, then I'll still have some left. Okay guys, so I decided to do one meal for dinner and then breakfast and lunch, only do the green smoothie. So I did that for breakfast and lunch today. I feel overall fine have my um electrolyte water so i don't feel all weird and funny and then this is going to be my dinner one medium uh chicken thigh one small chicken thigh and then some steamed broccoli with some pink himalayan sea salt and i will talk to you guys a little bit later hey guys okay so i'm gonna have an early dinner today um i did drink one of my green smoothies earlier today i'll show you well i kind of had some left from yesterday so I had this, this was part of my third one that I had, but you know, I only drunk the two, right? So I had that one and then I drunk the rest of this one here. So basically I had uh, an entire 12 ounces combined between those two. Plus I had some pineapples that I snacked on, some cucumber slices that I snacked on. And so now I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna have for dinner. I'm gonna have the two i'm gonna have two chicken thighs again and then i'll show you the salad that i made me and then i'll explain what i have in there okay so here's the salad that i have i have some reduced fat cheese on there from kroger cucumbers bacon bits and then i also have reduced fat hidden valley ranch on there which is on some iceberg lettuce between this and the chicken thighs that'll be dinner technically i believe is no dairy on here so don't come after me i'll just see if this uh setup is gonna work for me and then i'll let you guys know already though i'm already feeling less bloated after just one day and then i also did work out with my trainer yesterday so that counts and then I'll talk to you guys a little bit later. Okay, here's the chicken thighs that I made. 
one regular size one, like a medium size one and a small one. And then I'm almost done with the salad at this point. So I'll be eating these as soon as they cool down. I just cook mine in my air fryer, just FYI. I don't fry them or nothing like that. I just put them in the air fryer. All right, I'll talk to you guys a little later. So here's my salad with my dinner tonight. I'm just using the light Hidden Valley Ranch again. I've been repeating this this meal for like the past three nights, y'all. Like, <laughs> except for last night. Except for last night, I had this like kind of like a early dinner, and then my power went out last night, so it got real sketchy last night. But I just ended up having one of those smoothies, um, and then they gave me my two smoothies for the day, and then my dinner was kind of like midday. But same exact thing here. I have the light hidden valley ranch i have some bacon bits on iceberg lettuce some cucumber slices and the reduced fat kroger uh mexican cheese i don't have the i don't have any more the sharp cheddar so this is dinner also have the two chicken thighs in the air fryer right now so i'm going to start eating the salad and then i'll talk to you guys a little bit later i did have my two smoothies earlier today for breakfast and lunch and then i ended up snacking on a uh, green apple and i actually got some little um cashews just a small 110 calorie package okay so that's what i ended up having and then um I will talk to you guys in a little bit. I'm feeling so, so, so much better. I'll talk to you guys in a little bit and tell you kind of how I'm feeling overall, if I'm feeling a little bit lighter or what. All right, talk to you later. Okay, I got my two chicken thighs again, and I'm basically done with this salad, y'all. So I will talk to you later. I just wanted to show you what dinner was tonight. I probably won't even eat all this tonight because I'm actually kind of full from that big salad. That salad was pretty big, so. All right, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? It's the end of the weekend, but I still wanna turn up. Yeah, I still wanna turn up. All I want is to go again, but you ain't picking your phone up. Why you messing my head up? Any night, any day, let me take you away. Hey guys, so yesterday was my last day with the green smoothie cleanse replacing breakfast and lunch. Everything went good overall. Like next week, I believe I'm going to do the same exact thing because I feel like it's definitely manageable and i was able to see like some results fast so i'll show you guys like how like i'm looking like less bloated and all that stuff and then last night i ended up i did not have the same food that i had been having the other three nights but last night i ended up going out i had like some lamb chops and some fries that did not go with anything but still was looking good and feeling good and everything so but i would if i was you guys i would pick a healthier choice than what I did last night, okay? I did not get on the scale beforehand. I got on the scale after, but that's just, you know, at least I know like a starting point. And I'm actually back to where I was before I went on vacation. So I'm not tripping at all. So I'm happy about that. Feeling much, much better. I'll show you guys in a little bit, like I said, the side-by-side, -side, how I was looking before and then how I'm looking now. And then don't forget to hit the subscribe button. If you like content like this and until next time, bye.